Hmm. Keep. Fair enough. All right. Let's see. We're shot in port. Mm -hmm. Faster. Tune. Pedal. Yep. <clears throat> Show and tell. What did you bring to class? Recruiter of the guard. Let's go see if there's anything that recruiter can do for me here. I think that's a little too slow. Do I have anything in the main board that'll stop an Emrakul that can be tutored up with Recruiter of the Guard? I do have something that can beat Emrakul, but not off two mana. Uh, and that's a that's an issue. <clears throat> hmm. It's a Flicker Wisp. Hmm. Not beat Emrakul, but you know. It, it does something. It stops it for a turn. And even then, that's only off an Aether Vial. Back in the turn. Oh, yeah. Yep. So I basically need to just top deck Caracas. Or I'm out. It did not. <laughs> okay. That'll do it. That'll do it. Next game. Alright. Take two. See how we do. I'll be on the play. I like it. I love it. I'll take. I'll keep it. I'll also keep. I will play cavern on humans. Hi, mom. Most useful card in this match. Best turn. Utterly useless. <laughs> Your turn. Alright. Wasteland. Mm -hmm. Honestly, is it even worth it swinging for the one? Because if you have Pyroclasm, she can't protect herself anymore. I think I'd just wait. Pass turn. Ancient Tom. Uh oh. 18. Here we go. Show and tell. Uh, in response, Containment Priest. Okay. Now, that does mean you get to change your decision, of course. Um. Yep, um, I'll do nothing. Well, I will put a, another Mother of Runes out, just to super protect my containment priest. Uh, it would get exiled. Yes, it would. Um. This is my first time <laughs> playing this game. Oh my god, Jay, wait. You are an idiot. You are such an idiot. Um, in that case, it should have been a land. Because this only hits creatures. Astral. I even thought that right before I did it. <laughs> it's okay. We make these mistakes here so that we don't make those mistakes in a sanctioned event. Or so that we catch them from other people later on, too, I suppose. Uh, swing two. Sixteen. Another mother of runes. Damn. Um, we will waste your ancient tomb, and then pass turn. So wipe away or triple pyroclasm or bust. Um. Your turn. All right.
Two. Fourteen. Um, sword of fire, shock and draw. There we go. Last turn. Let's do. Always makes a color, sometimes makes a color, never makes a color. You quit? Mm hmm. Swing four. Shock. So, and draw. Well, actually, it's six because of the two from this. So, swing four and then two. Yeah. You know what I mean. Um, pass turn. So, now even wipe away. Doesn't get there. Yeah, I'll concede. Okay. You got me on the next swing. Well, unless you don't attack. No, no. I, I'll do what I have to. <laughs> Alright. There we go. You'll be on the play. I think. Yep, on the right. play. I'll keep. Nope. <laughs> three drops. Three drops do not get me there. And then a three drop coming up off the top. Nope. You're too slow. My goodness. And there we go, my friend. And while I'm resolving this mulligan. Five, six. That's no better. <laughs> no lands. I'm mulliganing, but I want to... Oh, it would have been a land. Yeah, okay, no. It still wouldn't have worked. Go five. Gotta have two lands for that containment priest. <laughs> That's it. Actually, an awful lot in this deck is, uh, if I have one land in an Aether Vial, I might be able to, but even then, that's more so on the play. And yeah, there's a little bit of a non-bow with Containment Priest and Aether Vial, which is why she's not main board. It's unfortunate, but it's true. So if you Aether Vial in a Containment Priest, does she get exiled? No, she's not. She doesn't use her ability until she's already out on the field. Um, it's a static ability, so it's not in place until she's out. However, if you have a Containment Priest and you try to file in another Containment Priest, of course, that'll mm -hmm. stop it. Alright, five. See how I do it. <laughs> God. Okay, we'll keep. Um, ooh. In, normally, yes, but in this case, I think that's not where I need to be. Okay. Alright. I'll play... Island. Yeah. Last turn. Alright. Wasteland. Aether Vial. Mm. Seems good. Last turn. Sure. Do you mind if I have a, one of your D6s? Sure. Thank you, thank you. Scalding turn. Last turn. Blip. Wasteland. It's a while. Okay. <laughs> it's one of those hands. Um, pass turn. Misty Reinforced. Uh oh. Your turn. Okay, so this one's on two. This one is on one. Draw a card. Caracas. Okay. Mm. Dahlia? 
Yep. Pass turn. Remind me for the next game, I'd like to get a toboggan cap to get my hair out of my face. It's not quite long enough to braid or put in a ponytail or anything to get it out. It's just long enough to annoy me. Misty Rainforest. Um. Last turn. End of turn. Aether Vile. Stoneforge Mystic. Okay. Yeah. Search. You're in here somewhere, buddy. Fire and ice. Mm -hmm. Shock and draw. I need to protect my Thalia. Point. I'll keep. Um. Three and two. Still on upkeep. That might actually. Uh, it's like a one in forty-five chance. I probably don't need to play around it. So I'll be dumb and I won't. Okay, it didn't happen. Combat. Two. Pass turn. Fetch. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fair enough. No more ponders and brainstorms with Fetchland, so I'm okay with that. A little bit. Is it time to bring something to class? Bloodbin. That's also a card that gets around it. Um so in response. Tap for Stoneforge Mystic. Obvious sort of fire and ice is obvious. 
Mm-hmm. Um, okay. Uh, still on the stack. I guess I could have played that a little differently, but I think this is right. I think that's correct. No, maybe it's no. Uh, no, I think we're fine. Okay. Resolves. Legendary mountain and a mountain. Pass turn. End of turn. Drop a mirror and crusader mm. off the three. End of turn. Drop a Stoneforge Mystic. Mm -hmm. So what I could have done there is searched up Batter Skull and then used the mana to drop the Batter Skull. But I think in this case, because of the Mirror and Crusader, it makes more sense to... Uh, Mirror and Crusader does 12 damage <laughs> when you put a, a sort of Fire and Ice on him. That's insane. Uh, four twice, and then he shocks twice because of Double Strike. It's protection but everything from everything but white. Yep. Yep. So, there be Batter Skull. Hear him roar. Alright. So, two cards in my hand, one of which I think I might have just shown you. In which case, I'm sorry. Alright. So, draw. Um. Equip. Wing for lethal. Yep, that's game. I had these three cards in my opening hand, and then I had nothing but lands. <laughs> oh man! And yeah, with Blood Moon, tomb. that through the breach is sick. That's a that's a thing. Yeah, this this card breaks. The, I've considered running it as a four of for this and Reanimator, but I think only three is fine because of Legendary. Um, so I think I mentioned earlier the Sword of Fire Nice is actually main board, uh, because mm -hmm. of True Name, along with GTA, which was sided out, and Batter Skull. Uh, GTA just doesn't do enough. In this match, Sword of Fire Nice does more of what I need. Mm -hmm. Um, bring in the two Containment Priests, which wanted to be a club together, down at the bottom. Uh, there's a Banisher Priest in here. It can be tutored up with Recruiter of the Guard, which is why I run it over like a Fiend Hunter. Uh, and it gives me an out against Resolve Permanence like that, like an Emrakul. There's a Sanctum Prelate. Uh, brought just about the whole tutor board in. Let's see. What else? There's one more card. Oh, uh, Council's Judgment as a 2 of. That's in here as well, the sideboard to get around cards like Blood Moon or like uh, Through the Breach. You can kill Emrakul with that too, right? I can also kill Emrakul, that's true. You know, if I, uh, you do what you have to do, I suppose. There it is. There it is. And then for the cards that I cited out, I brought out four swords to... Oh no, no, Sanctum Prelate's main board. I'm so, wait a minute, that doesn't add up. Sorry about that. Four, <laughs> your main board, dude. Just one. One Jite and four swords to plowshares. Mm. Um, that's all. Just gets the job done. Um, the rest of the tutor board, there's an Aegis, there's an Aethersworn Canonist, which almost came in, and then Fairy Macabre. Not that Aethersworn's all that great, but just that it's better than nothing. But then I thought Council Judgment might be better. Um, Canonist just slows you down, that's all. Okie dokie. And, yeah, double through the breach. That poor sleeve, man. That poor sleeve. Hey. My boy, Sulfur Elemental. Craig Wesco cried a little bit. And, uh, yeah, another wipe away. Okay, well, that's fair enough. Yeah, I'll just take out the, all the anti-counter uh, counter spell stuff. Gotcha. And so, since you didn't side out any show and tells, that means, what is it, four show, four sneak attack, two through the breach? Mm hmm Just to sort of turn into more of a, a combo deck, I guess? Yeah, I mean, it was either through the breach or intuition. Yeah, I, I think you made the right choice, actually. If I ever tap out with Caracas, not mm -hmm. expecting it, then, you know, then you can just get me that turn. Exactly. Well, fair enough.
good, good deal.